everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Or if you're new here, my name is Kayla and we are currently doing the 100 baby challenge. If you're unfamiliar, it is a baby challenge where you have one matriarch. This is Kayla here. And you have to have as many babies as possible before she turns elder. When she turns elder, then whoever her youngest daughter is, that is the one that takes over and tries to have as many. And we just continue that until we get to 100 babies. Now, we currently have 27 kids total. And I'm a little scared to think uh, what happens when the infants get here if I'm not done with this. That is a scary thought, so I want to make sure I can have as many babies, but um, we're a full household. Wendy is not going to age up. She's not good enough with her skill, and neither is Hannah. And then um, it's rolling into the weekend. Kayla is currently not pregnant, and we are seven days until she ages up into a normal adult. So honestly, I feel like we're doing pretty good. Um, not as great as I wish because I wish I had a baby in the tummy, but we did have our two twin boys over here. We have Josh and then we also have Cole. So that is something interesting. Um, I guess we're going to be working on some skills over the weekend. Maybe we'll get a lot of the twins aged up and um, then Monday rolls around and hopefully my Wendy and my Hannah are moved out. So I did a little something. I went and took a bunch of family photos with my children. Oh, there's Parker. And then we, oh, Chloe and Tracy and Sarah. We got Tiana and Levi. There's Levi, Tiana and Caleb. And then over on this wall, I have a whole bunch here too. These are all my other babies. Look at them, the twins. Aw. So cute, Leo looking great, Leo and Nathan. The, I so totally love them. Ava, Rose, Carl, our little fish face boy. <laughs> and so, yeah, that's what is going on. Our sweet little girl over here, she's just working away on some skills. Now let's check out how they're doing. So Macy, um, you know, she's only one in everything besides movement. They, I haven't really worked too hard on them. Oh my goodness, Carrie, look at you go. Since when are you working so hard? <laughs> oh, she's much better now, but she's tired. She was upset because she had an unwanted sibling, which is quite interesting because you know what? I feel like every kid does not want their sibling. Here you go, sweetheart. Go on and waddle down the hallway and head off to sleep. P.E. class. Bradley's P.E. class gets to run laps. Lots of them. <laughs> to build their stamina and lung capacity. He is mostly through the first lap when he notices a gap under the bleachers. Just right size for him to rest. Would coach notice if he sat out a few laps? You know what, that's not what we do here. You just keep running. Bradley glances around and decides it's too risky, but imagining that cool shade helps him pick up a little speed. Bradley finishes his laps with a new personal best time. Awesome job, Bradley. See, you don't ever want to just like not give it your all. Oh, of course the baby is awake when I'm doing that. Okay. Well, we'll do the best that we can. Oh, Wendy, you're home. Great. Come over here and bottle feed. And then Hannah, you come over here and change diaper and bottle feed. Nice. Change the diaper. Hannah. Hannah's a B student. Oh, you got your grade up to a B. Nice. Oh my goodness, she's given the attitude. Look at her. She's like, I don't wanna go and take care of them. And I'm so smelly. <laughs> okay, girls, let, oof. You girls are not doing well here. Okay, go and take a shower and then you can come in here 
and take a bath. That might help you. Mom, you can get over here and do some cooking. I feel like we haven't had mac and cheese in a while, so I'm gonna cook some mac and cheese. And then Macy, you can come and go to sleep, honey. If you wanna sleep up there? Go ahead. Why are you sad? Time to wear black. Sad because I'm sad, you wouldn't understand. Nobody would understand. Oh, poor girl. Dramatically cry about life and then go to bed. Maybe that'll help you out. Okay, perfect. Mom, you wanna go to the computer? How about you write? Write a screenplay. All right, you need to do writing skills and you need to do a little bit more cooking. Oh my gosh, we could have made you just late for school a little bit. Oh, that makes me so upset. Okay. Yeah, dramatically cry about your life. It's so rough, Wendy. I know. You're just tired. Go to sleep a little bit. Hey, Carrie, mommy's going to give you a bath, okay? Would you like to take a bath? You're super smelly. Dag, dag. Okay, Macy, you're hungry. Go and try out mom's famous mac and cheese. Are we supposed to feed this fish? No, okay. We don't have to do nothing with the fish. Awesome. Oof. Boy, you are looking rough over here. Mom needs to upgrade some of these beds, too. And once you get done taking care of all of your issues, you need to do your homework. Oh, I forgot you guys got a violin. Look at that. And you also don't need this little tablet thing. That's for the toddlers. Are you feeling better now, Wendy? You look like you're feeling better. Have a sim reach max level and handiness. Good job, mom. Look at you. Uh-oh. Baby. It's okay, sweetheart. Have a sim do nothing for 24 hours. And have a sim meet... What? What? Have a sim stay in a fine <laughs> state? Wow, we're just getting all the achievements right now. Hey, what are you doing over here, sweetheart? You're like almost done with that. Go play with dolls a little more. Hey, Hannah's got her cooking level up to three. Look at her nice cheese she made. Anybody want some cheese? Come and get your cheese, please. <laughs> Macy, you're hungry. Well, wake up, sweetheart. She's just laying in bed, super cranky. She's like, I'm so hungry. <laughs> Deciding if she wants to get out of bed or not, I guess. Well, come on over to the kitchen where the girls are just doing their homework. Mom, baby's crying. Oh my goodness, Cole. You are one cranky child all the time. It's almost Josh's birthday and Cole's. All right, we are going to potty train her because her potty is not quite there yet and she needs to be able to do that on her own. And also her potty's not quite there, but she needs some sleep. Oh my gosh, seriously, you're almost there. Mom, don't do that. We're gonna potty train her one more time. New Year's Eve, yay! Okay, awesome, you don't need to do that no more. You need to make your New Year's resolution and that's going to be to write a book. So how about, since you're in there, go ahead and write. Go write a children's story. You're gonna go running with your plate of food. It's motivating her. <laughs> Okay, well, you have fun doing that, and she's having a grand time. 
Oh no, Kayla's getting a call. Darwin! Uh, no. No, I don't think that's a good idea. Because we need to have a baby first. Oh my goodness. Hannah, can you come and mop all this up, please? Thank you. Polish that to perfection. Are you watching and having a good time? Okay, Hannah, you can give her a bath now, too. Go ahead and give Macy one. Yeah. Harry, let's go over here and you can grab something to eat and then go to sleep, my dear. Bradley is just having fun over there drawing. Um, we are going to have him grab a serving because he has now officially reached his skill to level four. Good job. So he can come and eat and then take care of some of his needs. Probably go to the bathroom and then head to sleep. Mom worked on that one, so I'm going to have him sleep over there. Wow, you are feeling so great. Why are you so upset? Aww. Let's have her grab a serving and then go to sleep. Oh my god, Hannah! Hannah! Look at her! I am gonna yell at her for hitting. Oh my god. Are you kidding me right now? Girl, uh-uh. Okay. We need to do some parenting here. Influence her to... Influence her to clean up the toys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you do not behaving like that, girl. Good job. Thank you so much for helping out. Uninstalled. Left, right, up, down, jump, jump, jump. Who likes this stuff anyways? Try as she may. Wendy just can't get into gaming. Should Wendy accept her gameless existence and finally comes to terms with the fact that she dislikes video game? Sure, I mean, she's a writer. She doesn't want to just sit there and waste her time doing that, I think. Macy, are you almost there? So close, yet so far away. All right, we're just going to let her finish pottying, and then she's going to go to sleep. I don't want her to get too cranky. Okay, Mom, now is your time. You are going to go and write your story. Hannah, what are you doing? You're cleaning up. Look at this girl. So nice. You're not doing that great with your manners or anything. Oh, which child am I going to have be my golden child? Because look at you're just not that great of a person either. All my kids just don't want to be good. Okay, maybe it's going to be Carrie. Carrie, are you going to be our nice child? Anger management. Oh, Sometimes I get so angry that I don't even know what to do with myself. How can I deal with things when I just can't even? To a workout, talk it through with someone, scream into a pillow. Talk it through with someone. Okay, let's put... Oh, you did put on the New Year's thing. Sabotage? No, go and watch it. You can come over here and also watch it. Wendy, you need to wake up so you can be here. Woohoo! We finished our book just in time. Enraged? Oh my gosh, what is wrong? It's tough being a teen sometimes. Emotions are hard to keep in check. Yeah, they are. Oh my gosh, Wendy, you'll be all right. Come and watch the TV with us. It's almost the new year. Everyone's completed their New Year's resolutions already. <laughs> so I think it's going to be pretty successful. It's kind of weird that they all say the same thing and do the same thing at the same time. It's like they're glitched. All right, five, four, three, 
two, one. Happy New Year! <laughs> They're like, Yaba, that was good. We're done. You're so enraged. Can you do something? Go jog to clear your mind. Girl, you'll be all right. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mom's also gone to sleep and look at that. We're back down to five days now. <gasps> oh no. And what is today? Today is new skill day and also it is Cole and Josh's birthday. Ah, it was my birthday on Friday. That's not happening. No, thank you. So it is new skill day. I have not seen what happens with that one quite yet. I guess I haven't really paid attention to it. So it'd be kind of interesting to see that one. Oh, I forgot we have wrote our book so we can sell our book. Oh. Okay, let's go and submit our book to there. That's interesting. That's new. It's Josh's birthday. Time flies, doesn't it? And it's also Cole's birthday. Okay, as soon as mom is done here, we are going... Well, actually, you know what? Scratch that, mom. It is time to age up these babies. We will just come over here and straight up age up Josh. Josh, you are cranky. It's okay, Josh. Mom is on her way to age you up. You will be good in no time. Oh my gosh, look at Tiana's outfit. Okay, Josh has aged up and he is... Oh, he's our little angel. Okay, Josh. Maybe you are going to be the one that is our angel kid and has our super awesome manners and everything. Yep. That's what we're going to do. Josh is going to be it for us. Look at him. Oh, so cute, Josh. Whoa. Should we make Josh kind of look like a little doctor since he was named after our medical intern? <laughs> Here we go. And Cole is clingy. All right, we got our two children. Look at you boys. Yep, just walk right through that bassinet. Awesome. You can go play dolls. Look at him instantly. He's like, I am going to play some dolls. And what are you going to do? You're going to go watch him? Well, you could just play with him. Look at them. Oh, so sweet, my boys. <laughs> okay, let's potty train Josh. Oh, Carrie, you're awake. And Carrie also needs potty. Mom, what are you doing? Don't do that. Let's potty train Carrie, actually. These boys can do their own thing. Go play some dolls. Go play dolls. There we go. All right, Carrie, you gonna come over here and we're gonna get that skill going. I still don't get how her movement is so horrible. Shockingly, movement is gonna be like the one of the last things that she gets done. And we have such a big house, so it's not like it's a small thing for her. Why does that look so nasty? Oh no, it's springtime, so things are starting to melt. Never mind. I thought the dollhouse got dirty. Josh, are you watching Carrie? Look at her go. That's how you potty. Hey, Carrie, it is nice out. How about you go and see what that is? And then climb up to it. I am going to have you potty train Cole. We are just working on all of these little toddlers. There's too many in this household right now. Oh, no. Okay, Hannah, you're asleep. I'm going to have you go potty. And then I would like you to come over here and teach to teach shapes to... Um, 
Let's see, who actually needs to do shapes? There's so many of them, I don't know what to do. Wendy, you can teach some shapes to him. How about that? Teach shapes to Cole. Macy has reached potty level three. Awesome job, Macy. Macy, you just need communication and imagination and some thinking. Oh my goodness, you are rough right now. Go over here, babble away. Awesome. Okay, Wendy, potty train. Cole. Awesome, Carrie, you're now potty. Okay, you just need a potty. I feel like we need more potties in here. We have so many children going on. Let's get another potty. What are you working on? Okay, you're gonna need to use the bathroom, but go into mom's room to use it. And then you can chat in a kid's chat room. I think that is good. Everyone's gonna be doing their own little thing. Good job, Macy, you don't need to do that no more. So Macy uh, needs a little bit of imagination and then her thinking up. So once you eat, go ahead and play dolls and then play some sim shape. Yeah. Okay, you're taking care of yourself. Carrie, are you getting potty trained? Yes, you are. Because Hannah is such a good big sister. Hannah's potty training you and that is the only thing that you need is potty. Mom is getting some well-needed rest. You actually go to sleep. Just fully sleep. Aw, Josh, you're so cute. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, Hannah. She just went ahead and is like, I'm going to teach her some of these flashcards. What a good job. Hannah, you are not mean at all, my dear. You are so nice. I love how the other kids are taking care of all of the toddlers and mom is just getting some well-needed rest. Look at her. She is enjoying that. Macy! Are you good, girl? I think Macy just needs her thinking. Yeah, what she's starting to work on now. So once she's able to get that up, then we'll have her work on that, probably. Oh my god, Hannah is just enjoying her time with her sister. Wow. Carrie, why are you sad? Flash, time for a break? Oh, so then Hannah played with her? That is adorable. And look at him sitting over there by the table. I know it's not as high as before, but that's a good spot. Alright, once you're all done doing that, now that you're happy... You can go and go potty. Okay, good to know that you guys weren't made for each other. Because give me the day and then we will be good to go. I have just kind of left this little dude to do his own thing. Because we have not... We have not had enough time here. There's so many kids going crazy. Wendy, clean that up. And then clean this up. And then clean that one up, too. Nice. Yay, Carrie! You did it, girl! Mom is so proud of you. What kind of cake do we want? I think we'll do a chocolate cake for them. Okay, you just need some more thinking. <gasps> Uh-oh! No, no, no! In a calm voice, ask her not to smash her dolls. Oh, now he's so sad. Okay, well, you go to sleep. Girl? I don't think so. Mom's gonna have to repair that now. Before I can come over here. Oh my gosh! What are you doing? Oh, now I have to discipline you in a strict voice. You're not going to be doing that either. I don't think so, Missy. 
She's just gonna try and walk away and act. I don't think so. I am gonna give you time out. You're getting time out. Not cool. Yeah, now you're in time out. You sit there. I don't care if you're upset. Oh my God, everyone is crying. Why are you sad? Oh, from there, okay. It's okay. My kids are losing their minds. <laughs> How is this Sunday so crazy? She's going to play with Carrie. So cute. Mom, what are you doing? Oh, you're going to hug your children? Look at how crazy this looks right now. Holy goodness. That was a crazy household for a little bit there. But I think you're all good and you're all good. Our girls are all good. So as soon as mom's done putting her to sleep, then we are aging these children up. Don't you grab that cake. <gasps> Don't you eat the cake. That was a little premature, don't you think? Hannah, as soon as you're done that, we need to add some birthday candles to that cake. Okay, it must be in the center of a table. I'm going to set that right there for now. And then get rid of this. And I'm going to add in like a little island because I feel like that would be super cute to have for us to get a good look at them. Okay, perfect. Now we can have... Oh, wait, mom, 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 no, don't, 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 stop right now in the name of everything. <gasps> I just said blow out candles. Oh, my goodness. And you just smashed that? What is going on in this household right now? Okay, we are going to discipline her behavior in a firm voice. With our disappointment. Okay. Oh, I think we are saved. Okay, this is like crazy. My brain cannot handle all this. Oh, okay, mom's gonna go and like yell at Macy. So, Hannah, you can help blow out candles. Yeah, you can help Carrie blow out her candles. Don't put Carrie to bed. Just help her blow out her candles. She's good to go. Look at that. <laughs> She's ready to be a little kid. Get out of this toddler stage. <laughs> Yay, go Carrie. Yifta May. Can I add some birthday candles there? Okay, Carrie. She is a little bookworm. Aw, Carrie is our little whiz kid who is also a bookworm. Look at her. Oh my god, for so cute. Okay, mom. Come here and help blow candles for Macy. Look at you, Carrie. You know what that means, though, girl? You gotta do your homework. Blow out your candles. Lactose intolerant? Oh my god, the sick will become... This sim will become sick if they eat dairy, but will feel great if they have avoided it for a while. Cool. Pick a number one through four. And we also have another whiz kid. Oh my God, the girls are so cute. Okay, mom, before anyone does anything else, add some birthday candles to that. Okay, look at there's Macy. Look how cute she is. Love that. All right, clean out your spoiled food that's in ya. Do your homework. You're gonna teach him to talk? She has like got the motherly instincts like crazy. I love it. Bradley, are you like all right over here? He's just been chatting this entire time while everything else is breaking out in the house. So horrible. He's just chatting away. Have a nice salad. And we have to pay attention now because we have a lactose intolerant kid. We should probably get rid of this cheese. He's so tired. Leave him alone. Look at his skills. She has been just working extra hard on Josh, getting all of his skills up like crazy. 
And like, look at Cole. The kids are doing so awesome. It's crazy. Oh, and Wendy, you're going to play with your sister and just like, that's it? Oh, I meant that your brother? Oh my god. I'm losing my own mind. My children are just making me lose my brain cells. Get off of the computer and go take care of your needs, Bradley. Okay, I think things are starting to calm down around here a little bit. That was crazy. There was way too much going on. My brain can't handle all of that. <laughs> Oh, my children stressed me right out. Okay. Oh my goodness. Hannah's gonna need to cook us some food too. We're almost all out of food. Mom's working on her painting and then she'll do some food. She can do that. What else can we do? Whew, I feel like I can finally breathe. Everyone's asleep. They're doing good right now. Bradley's just playing his video games here. Look at that, I've fallen out of love with everyone. Since when do you know this Stacy person? Ooh, I can also write a love email to Josh. I'm gonna write a love email to Josh. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start working on the next dude. All right, it's almost school time. I'm super excited because we need to get a baby in us. Oh my gosh, mom's down to four days now. We cannot let this happen again. I just love the way that her hairstyle is. That's so cute. Cute. Oh my goodness, the kids are off to school. Okay, you guys, have a great day. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy for you guys. You all are gonna do fantabulous and study hard. What are you doing? No, you're gonna be late for school, you guys. Go to school. Mm, look at these two. They were just so worried about playing some chess that they're like, oh yeah, I'm gonna be half an hour late. Bradley. I wonder if that's a good excuse. Um, sorry, I was busy playing some chess. Missed bubble. Another standardized test. Macy is almost done when she realizes she skipped a bubble near the top. Her answers are off. She starts to tell the teacher, but realizes she'll have to take it again. It's really only the state. It doesn't affect her grade. Um, confess the mistake. Just as Macy has feared, the teacher scolds her for her carelessness and makes her come back to at recess to take it again. Angry Macy fills in pretty pattern, not even looking at the questions. Macy! Ah! Teaching our little Josh how to say please and thank you and say sorry. Bradley became a better student and got his grades up considerably. Good job. Okay, mom, when you're done, you got to come and pay the bills. Oof, man. $3,000 for our bills in this house. <gasps> That's rough. That's really rough. How you doing, Josh? Level two of movement. Oh, yeah. Oh, Josh loves the slide. Look at him. Wee! Super fast. Usually the kids are scared of it, but not Josh. Oh my god, Mom. Are you good? Mom decided she didn't want to run on the treadmill. Kind of freaked her out, so she's going to go and take a cute little jog around the neighborhood. See who she can come across. And we're just going to have Josh work on his sliding here. He'll be all right. But grades are up. Yes! Okay, let's see. You're an A student, so Wendy, Hannah's an A student, Bradley's an A student, and the girls are B students. Hannah's just gonna make their cake. Oh my gosh, her last little bit here in the house. Hannah, I am so proud of you. You are such a great daughter. I really do just love her so much. You know, she was our mean little girl, but at the same time, she was super responsible and loving. Blow out your candles. It's time for you to age up, my dear. Okay, our mean genius is now somebody that hates children. You know what? She had a house full of a bunch of siblings, so I don't blame her. And she wants to live in the cities. Okay. There you are. I am so proud of you. <gasps> Good job, Wendy. Oh my god, no! Wendy wants to be a public enemy. 
She's a perfectionist who's a bookworm and a glutton. There is our Wendy. Let's add some birthday candles to there because now it is your turn to blow out some candles, Bradley. Yay, Bradley, go! Aw, so cute. Macy's celebrating him. And Bradley is a foodie. Ooh, I cannot wait to see what he looks like. Okay, Bradley wants to have a successful lineage. He's erratic and a foodie. Look at Bradley. Nice, Bradley. Add some birthday candles to that cake so nobody does anything with it. It is time. We cannot waste another moment. It is time to move our children out. Wendy, who is always just cleaning and doing such a great job. And then Hannah, who is such a great parent. Like, look at her. She's checking on the baby. But I'm sorry, my dears. You guys have to move out. Mom needs a baby. Okay, Hannah and Wendy officially do not live here anymore. Mom, it is time for you to invite to hang out at the current lot. A uh, dad. Oh my God. Where are you, Darwin? We need you. Give him a nice kiss, sexy pose, do all that good stuff. Okay, let's ask him about his woohoo interest. See if that works. Okay, now we can try for a baby. Are we pregnant? Darwin, did you do it? Or were you just a big waste of time this whole time? Eating for two. Oh, thank goodness. Finally, we got another baby on the way. Go tell him the issue because he's going to have quite the issue with it. She's like, I'm pregnant. Oh, it wasn't so bad. All right. Now that you did that, come and write a little love email to Josh. Yeah. Okay, mom is now pregnant, and here we have our sweet boy. He's just working on some skills. Uh, Carrie's going to be at the park. She's playing. We'll work on some skills there. Look at Josh. Josh literally just needs some potty and thinking. And then Cole. Like, they're pretty decent with all of their stuff yet. But... <laughs> I am so glad that we are officially pregnant. Mom is happy about that. I'm happy about that. We are at four days until we age up into an adult. I think we're doing fantastic. I'm going to leave this episode here. Wow, it was filled with some stress, but it's okay. We're back on track, and I am so happy and excited about that. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Don't forget to hit a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!